Manage your event. Go to add-ons. Activate live streaming. The QR code is the link to your live streaming. Go to settings. Here you can see the settings. Activate show heading banner if you want to show banner on the top page. Upload your banner. Always update your setting after every changes to take effect. And you will see the banner on top. Let's change the page background. But we need to turn off show sample photo to show the background. Choose a color. Activate show sample photos to see the live streaming preview. Customize the entrance and exit animations. You can select from variety of animations provided on the drop-down menu. You can also set the speed of animation. Image time is the length of image to show on the screen. Now try to click on pause animation. You can see the animation on preview stops overlay background it will show when there is an incoming image you can set the color and opacity of the overlay background update your setting after every changes now click on show live streaming to preview the output as you can see the overlay background helps incoming photo to pop up from the background images now let's proceed Enable the slideshow. This will show the latest images to show after a desired minutes inputted. Auto scroll the page. This will help the guests or viewers to see the old photos. When activated, the page will scroll up and down from time to time. You can add branding ads by activating show branding ads. Upload your ad. It will show an ad whether it is an image or a video in full screen. Set branding interval to show your ads in minutes. Branding show time is the time of an ad to appear. Always update your setting after every changes to take effect. Basically, if you're using video, the length of your video must be the same as your branding show time, so that it will not cut the ad if you put less than the video length. You're good to go.